Hey friends, it's Anna McHugh here out on my morning run, so I'm not going to show you my face, but I came across uh, a pretty good example of Chlorophyllum molybdites, also known as the green sport parasol. And this is considered a toxic mushroom. Um, it does make people sick pretty regularly uh, if they consume it. My understanding is that some people are able to actually, uh, you know, boil it a time or two and enjoy it. But the thing I wanted to highlight about this mushroom uh, and this particular specimen is that in past videos, I've talked about uh, the green sport parasol and I've talked about these scales that appear on the side of them and you can see they're sort of like, uh, you know, a little bit curly. And on the top, you have a, sort of a darkened, uh, you know, area or patch of tissue that's going to break apart. And so, um, you know, there are a lot of other parasol mushroom species, some of which are delicious and edible. But this sort of almost like, I think of it almost like pencil shaving, sort of scaliness, is oftentimes like the first thing that I see. And I'm like, oh, that's probably chlorophyllum. Um, in addition to that, you can see underneath, it's got some really beautiful texturing here. And also the beginning of, let me take it apart here. Uh, you can see when I open up the mushroom, it has uh, currently sort of whitish gills. Let me see if I can get that better. So white, white, tightly packed gills that are a little bit pale, but as the mushroom opens up and matures, uh, that will turn sort of a greenish color as the spores mature and also leaves this really cool, big double ringed, uh, sort of, uh, or, you know, double layered felty ring on the stem. Anyway, that's all I have for you. I just wanted to point out, like I saw this and I'd, I'd made videos before and described these as almost like uh, colored pencil shavings, these scales, but I saw this fella and I'm like, that's a perfect example. So I'm gonna stop my run and uh, talk to my mushroom friends for a minute. So now that I've done that, I hope you have a great day.